It is repetition which makes for perfection. Expressions. As far as traditional comics with, uh, you know, you know, with the, the hard, the gritty look versus the, the more softer, cartoony shapes. When you go in the cartoony side, you have, you have more flexibility to, 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 to show more expressions. Um, you know, and it's, it sort of depends on art. Some, sometimes you find an artist who's drawing something and they're really good at just bringing it out specific expressions and you know even though it doesn't matter what character it is they're really good at doing this but some some people uh but some characters they don't typically lend to expressions too much you can't really like if you have if you're drawing batman you wouldn't show an expression like as uh like if you were going to draw him for a traditional comic versus because if you're working on some batman animated film or something you wouldn't have uh the same expressions there's going to be something different between them so um let's say you were doing like um uh, say you're doing like some kind of crazy animated batman right say you're doing it like this you're like oh this is batman animated and doing something like this, maybe just browse like this, right? You would have a lot more flexibility to push this if you were doing, um, you know, you want to draw him with like, hey, some big crazy looking eyes, like, whoa, he's, he's like surprised. You would even maybe change his brow a little bit. Um, you know, this is really, this is really, really rough, but it just gives you a, a sense of things. And you, you could possibly even play with bending his ears back a little bit. And like, ah, this is the Batman animated type of weird expression type of thing he's doing. And, you know, this is where you kind of have fun with it. So you can just play around with this. So you can shoot, you can do something like that. Or maybe you could, uh, Go ahead and express him a little more. Like, he's really, really angry. I like making noises too. I don't know if you guys. I guess that's my uh, my what, what do you call it, Hannah? That's my that's my my mark. It's like Batman. Maybe you can even have fun and play around with his ears a little bit. You know, like Argh. he's just. Really angry. Ah, give him like some crazy looking teeth. You can go to sleep. Can we join a late night with RV? Yeah. Hey, Drana, thank thanks for uh, uh, showing up. Ah, like he's looks like he's like laughing or something. So this would be more like like a, an animated expression type of thing, okay? Let's say you were doing um, something a little bit more serious. Um, so you have like a Batman type of... Um, Let's say you were drawing. This is just rough. So let's say you were doing something like that and you'd want to do something more. Um, you know, you want to express him a little bit more. Maybe you want to push his head back a little bit. Kind of like uh, you'd say he's surprised or something. He's surprised that the, that the Joker just. Um,
Joker did something funny to him. So he's like, but you know, I wouldn't really, you know, you, I mean, this is Batman, so you would have less, um, a little bit less to play with. Why am I messing up on that eye? It doesn't make sense. Rawr. So you want to pull this head back a little, maybe show it on nostril, somewhere around here. Somewhere on me. He's like, oh snap. He's like, oh snap, Robin. Holy barnacles, Batman. Uh, yeah, somewhere around here. Let's see, Batman's like kind of like expressing something. I don't get those. No, we don't look right. So, you know, play around it a little bit more. That's the car he is watching the stream while driving. Uh oh. Don't crash your car. I hope someone else is driving. I don't want to be responsible for this, for anything that happens. You were just a busy man. Yeah. I was just there, me and Hannah, we were, we were just there uh, recently, a couple days ago. So, um, yeah, something, you know, like that. So, Batman would have like some crazy, you know, or he's shocked. He's like, I am shocked. I am shocked and she grinned, Robin. You hurt my feelings. And um, let's say you do so something like that. Or maybe you might want to just maybe, you know, turn his head a little bit. I'm just going to lower this so you can get a sense of things. I want to turn his head maybe. Maybe he, he saw poison poison ivy and he's like it's like wait a minute was that poison ivy? I gotta make sure. Oh, he, oh no, that Batman's voice is more like was that poison ivy? <laughs> that was poison ivy. <laughs> I smell I smell poison. I like I like making noises. Um, I like a acting out my characters when I'm drawing them, because it kind of and it's it's and this is another thing too. Bat Batman doesn't really change his expression too much, unless he's like Rrr. maybe something like this. Maybe why am I getting this little? Do we have mosquitoes now? I got a mosquito that's buzzing. Window open. Is there mosquitoes in California? I've never seen them. But you know, you get a sense of this. So you know, you can want to play around him. Uh, you know, maybe you want to make him a little bit more with his eyes like this. He's like, eh. Uh, fiance is driving. Oh, his fiance is driving. Okay, good. So you can watch. Stop. He's, this is him bugging me. Wildstorm says the face of Batman's getting a presidential alert on the back. Yeah. He's like, what was that? Toot says Batman talks like he has 10 pounds of gravel in his throat. <laughs> yeah. And, yeah. I like to give, uh, you know, Batman this little, whatever this little pocket down here thing is. I don't know. This thing is so Why can I ask, can you show facial expressions on... Like a no mask character, like Superman. Like okay, that. yeah, I can do that. Lips are so confusing. Lips. Okay, so um, how would you do lips? 
for guys, you tend to want to just kind of draw something like this. You, want to, you don't want to do too much. You could just get away with just like that line and that. That's it. That's all you can do from, for, uh, for lips. You want to open his mouth up a little bit. You can open it up like this. Show some, some teeth. Just go ahead and just show some teeth. Another thing about teeth, don't ever, you don't have to draw um, every single tooth. Don't do that. This looks too, it looks too forced. And then especially, let's say your, um, um, your, this thing goes to print. It looks great like that. And then when it prints, it goes to a little tiny little thing like this. And then next, you know, it's like it turns, it, it gets muddy because, because when it turns to print, it starts getting darker like this. And then it can, it can get muddy. So I wouldn't do that. So just try to stay away from that as much as possible. What I would do um, is just draw a little bit. Don't need, I would like the teeth in the front. Just keep it just keep it simple but as it's going back let's say this this is do this is draw the whole tooth out right so you're drawing whatever my teeth are crooked whatever so it's one two one two and then yeah so i got it right so this is the the incisors right that's what it's called and we're going to go towards the ones in the back. Even on teeth, I make noise. Okay. Let's say this is a teeth. What you want to do when you're drawing teeth, this is how you want to think of it. So you're drawing someone's mouth. This, and you're like, okay, this is a person's mouth, right? And it's opened up slightly, and you get to see a little bit of teeth. Just go ahead and just keep the front area clean, and then, then you can start adding details on the ones in the back. Just kind of indicate. You don't have to show every single thing. Just that's all you need. Why? Because the color is going to fill in the rest of the, the rest of the blank. You don't need to add anything else to it. Just keep it simple. Like that. Like that. Just keep it simple. And then keep this kind of like, yeah, like. If you want to, you can add a top part of the lip. And the reason, and this is what I'm doing. I'm, I'm only going to hit like major parts where there's a crease, something like that. You don't have to draw the whole lip out. You don't have to. Um, it just kind of kills it. So what I like to do is just kind of draw, draw this part, and then maybe draw a couple lines over here on the side, maybe some more over here, and that's it. And, and then from there, I, you, if, if there's anything else, you can go ahead and, you know, just add more here and there just to kind of enhance, you know, the feel a little bit. That's pretty much it. Okay? So just kind of keep it simple. You don't have to draw everything. You don't have to kill yourself over this. Just keep it simple. And if you have a crease, go ahead. If it's an old guy, if there's, you know, cracks on those lips or whatever, go for it. Do it, you know. But you want to keep it simple, you know. Let's say he has a giant scar or because of uh, he's battle-worn. And he has, like, you know, a little bit of stubble on his beard.
Maybe. Man, you guys got me going. This is supposed to be short, and I'm having fun. I don't want to. I don't feel like coloring. <laughs> so, like, I don't want to color. I just want to keep penciling. I'm a penciler at heart. Wow. Okay. So yeah. Do you ever use a mirror for expression? Yes. Yes. Super John Boyd says make him make him missing a tooth. Okay. Which one? Maybe <laughs> you always make a missing tooth right here. If it's one tooth, yeah, so this tooth right here will be missing. Stop. Look at that. What's wrong with this? Missing two. Someone punched his tooth out. And you could, if you want to, just go ahead and go up bottom. Tiny bottom row. Keep it simple. Don't kill it. And then when you're done, you give that to your inker, and then your inker goes goes to town on it. Now you see how I'm drawing the beard. Um, I'm not trying to draw every single little strand and keep it perfect just go don't you know don't keep it in the, that rough sketchy mode um, and if you have to layer it you know if you have to and and to enforce it you can you know crisscross some lines across like that you know just to kind of reinforce some, something like you want to reinforce the the, the, the facial structure go for it you know, so I'm I'm just having fun with this. Stay messy. I like to tell people to stay messy. So let's paste some room in there. Yeah. So um. So um. So yeah. So that's basically. What I had to do with that. I wish to thank you for your kind reception and bid you a fond farewell.